Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Dean Michelle with Top Notch Designs and today we are going to go over another yes zipper tutorial. This is an easy repair on a zipper so uh, yeah you can do this at home so you don't have to take it to a tailor. This is actually a very simple fix. So do you have a zipper that looks like this? where your pull broke off of your slider. This is a double pull zipper, meaning it needs two pulls to zip up the zipper. But the pull on here is broken. So instead of replacing the whole zipper, we're going to just replace this top slider. Now, the first thing you want to check for um, is to make sure there are no teeth missing on your zipper and that they're all in great shape and this one looks good so let's go ahead and go over everything that you're going to need for this first you're going to need your jacket of course then you're going to need your new slider you're going to need some top stops you're going to need some needle nose pliers these are the little um, mini ones, some mini uh, nippers, and some zipper pliers. These will be helpful in the end. You don't have to have these, but they're very helpful. All of these items can be purchased on Amazon or at your local um, crafting and fabric store. So let's go ahead and get started. So the first thing you want to do is pull your flap back. You're going to take your needle nose and you're going to pull this all the way back so that you're going to expose your zipper here, your zipper top stops. So as you can see, this is your little top stop. We're going to take our nippers and we're going to break that off. And be careful when you do this because they fly everywhere. So close your eyes. And then you're just going to remove that. Then we're going to take our slider, just the top one. The bottom one is just fine, so we don't need to do anything with that. We're going to take this, pull it all the way to the top. This is not going to come off very easy because there's no pull on here. So we're going to take our needle nose and just kind of yank it off the top like that. Then you're going to take your new slider. And we're going to just put that on the top there. And sometimes you might have to finagle a little bit and put it on. All right, now we're going to test this and make sure it's going to work. So what you need to do is make sure that both of your sliders lock in position like this and line up. They have to be lined up in order to be able to zip this. If they're not lined up, they will not zip. We're going to take our other side, our other pin box, and we're going to push it through both. And then we're going to zip up your jacket. Give it a little tug, just a small one, to make sure that it's not going to open up. Make sure your slide is good. And you're going to zip it all the way up to make sure that it's good and that there really is no teeth broken. And once you've inspected it completely and you see there are no teeth broken, you can go ahead and take your new top stop here. And we're going to go ahead and take our zipper pliers. And we're just going to go ahead and attach that. And we're going to give it a good pinch on this side. And we're going to give it a good pinch on this side. And there you have it. You can replace both top stops or you can just replace the one. Because this one is in the flap and no one's going to see it, I'm not going to replace both. So that is how you replace your broken uh, slider on a double slider or two-way zipper. All right. 
I hope this tutorial was helpful for you. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments below. Otherwise, I thank you for watching, and I hope you guys have a top-notch evening. Until next time, goodbye for now. Thank <laughs> you.